Hi everyone, I'm Meredith Abbott and welcome to Sir Latab. Today I'm going to be demonstrating how to break down a whole chicken. To get started, you don't need anything other than yourself, a sharp knife. I like to use a boning knife for this. It's very kind of delicate work and you don't need a heavy knife to break through bones or anything like that. We are going to be removing everything at sockets and joints. What I'm going to do first, I'm going to take the legs off. I'm gonna cut through the skin just with the tip of the knife. So I'm just working with some really thin, short cuts to work myself my way around. And then you can start to open things up. We're looking for the socket. So if you pull that back a little bit, you can see where that's exposed. And I just like to come in here and get as much of that meat as possible. There's one leg. So short little cuts just to separate that leg. Work yourself around like so. Pull it back a little bit. You can see that joint. You can get in there with the tip of your knife like so, get those fingertips out of the way. There's your legs. Now before I move on, I'm just going to remove the drum from the thigh. So again, this works like another joint. You can see it on this side, kind of where that fat line is. So it just takes some thin cuts with the tip of your knife as you expose kind of that ball joint. Like so. There you go. And cut through. So you have your thigh and a drum. We'll do the same to this one. Short, nice little cuts to expose where you're working. Like so. You have your two drums, two thighs. Now I like to start by stretching the skin back over the breast so you can really see that backbone. Start by where the neck was, cut through that skin completely. Trace down to the side of that backbone, like so, cut through that skin. And then make some thin cuts until you hit the rib cage and you'll feel that just with some thin little swoops of your knife. And then you start working your way down that rib cage. The breast meat will kind of start falling away. Make sure you're cutting all the way through like so. So there's your breast with the wings still attached. We'll take that off next after I take this one off. So you can just work your way down that rib cage following those bones, cutting through the skin. You're gonna see another ball socket Come right through that. And there's our second breast. So the chicken carcass, you can hold on to, stick in your freezer, save for chicken stock, or it can be added to uh, any sort of soup or stew. Now I'm just going to remove the wing from the breast so it's totally boneless. So very easy about just taking the tip of your knife, working down until you see that socket, pulling it off. Now you have a completely boneless but skin on chicken breast, which is a nice thing to have. That skin is always going to add a bit more flavor to your recipes. And you, it's hard to find boneless skin on chicken breast in your grocery store. So this is a great technique and method for you to learn. So here are your boneless skin on chicken breasts, your two wings, two thighs, two drums, and your chicken carcass to make your own chicken broth. Enjoy. For recipe videos, cooking classes, and more, visit surlatob.com.